try this tip for helping you stay ahead of your holiday clutter and start the new year on the right foot. In this episode, you're listening to A Little Debbie. It's a bite-sized version of the longer podcast, Upcycling with Deb. I'm your host, Deb Colometta. I wrote a number one best-selling book called Best Offer, Best Life. And you can get in touch with me and find out more information about the classes I offer, webinars or debinars, by going to my website, www.thedebsite.com. Dot com. We are in the crunch zone here. If you've got young kids and you are ready to face an onslaught of incoming toys and junk and holiday stuff in your space, this episode is for you. Now, to me, it's still too early to think about Christmas. I'm like Nordstrom's, not that I'm bougie, but more like I have a rule of give Thanksgiving its moment. But if you do have a long weekend coming up, this is the perfect time to think about clearing out your space. Be aggressive as you purge. And as you find treasures, try to repurpose them. If you post unplayed with toys, because let's face it, we all have those hiding in the corner of our toy closets or toy rooms, you might be able to give an unused toy to other parents that you know, and maybe they can give it to their child as a great Christmas gift or a pre-Christmas gift even. You know, do what you can to help Santa out this year. You'll get rid of some extra things you don't need that aren't played with. And if you're lucky enough that Santa does rain down favorably upon you with all those new gifts, you're going to have more space available and it will feel less crowded on Christmas morning. Resist the temptation to wait until Christmas vacation. Instead, take the time to really relax and enjoy the transformation instead of getting stressed out by all the excess junk. Don't wait until your house is ready to burst at the seams before you start this. The best cure for overbuying is a big purging spree. And the best cure for a shopping spree is a purging spree because nothing kills your appetite for new junk, like having cleared out your garage or your attic or your basement. Go through those steps beforehand and it will prevent you from overbuying. Trust me, or at least it'll help. 